lovely couples and welcome back to my channel. I'm Lauren, wedding planner and owner of Bluebird Creative. I provide a weekly dose of wedding planning goodness for the modern couple. So if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the bell guys because then you'll be notified every week when a new video lands. This week I am going to be diving in and showing you my favourite tools for planning your wedding. Some of these are free, some of these are paid for. I'm gonna give you a selection of my absolute favorites to help make your wedding planning a little bit easier because that would be nice, wouldn't it? So let's just jump straight into this week's video. Okay, so my first one is an absolute freebie and I have actually done a video on solely this product before so I will link it up here for you but I am of course talking about With Joy which is a wedding website website do you know what I mean <laughs> this website is absolutely amazing the functionality that it has and the options that it gives you to create your own wedding website to let your guests know what information they need for the wedding day, any travel information, any accommodation information, basically whatever you wanna put on your website, it can host it. It also can send out invites for you. It can track RSVPs, you can track dietaries, you can collate your bridal party and so on. It's a really good website and like I said, it's free. So definitely, definitely, go check that one out. Another good freebie, which you may already know of by now, is my free wedding planning checklist. Absolute freebie, guys. Takes you through 12 months of what to do when planning your wedding. And obviously then you can just adapt that depending on how long you've got before your actual wedding day. So if you haven't already got that one, then again, I will link that below as well as all the products that I'm talking about today, whether they're free or paid, I will link them all down below for you so you can go and investigate and get that wedding planning slick and smooth and stress-free because that's what we're all about. So the next product that I want to talk to you about is Aisle Planner. Oh my days, I love Aisle Planner. Now this is actually a professional wedding planning software. So if you are an aspiring wedding planner or if perhaps you are a wedding planner and you're watching my channel, this one is for you guys. I use Aisle Planner to help keep track of all the weddings that we're planning and that we're coordinating and that we're working on in one place. It's absolutely amazing. In fact, I will have a little pop-up that comes up now for you to show you some of the functionality. I absolutely love it. So I can track the checklist of what we're doing and when we're doing it. I can fill in the full timeline for our client's wedding, what's happening right from the beginning of the day all the way through to the end of the wedding day. I can add in notes. I can also add in who has the responsibility for what. Everything can be downloaded into a PDF. Some of them can even be downloaded into a spreadsheet. It's such a good software. You can also create your own wedding website on Isle Planner, although I have to say that is very basic and it doesn't have much option to personalise it, but it does the job. You can also track your RSVP, send out your invites, send out your save the dates, track everything, track dietaries, add meals. You can do your table layouts. You can do your seating plan. There is a lot of functionality, adding all the contacts for your suppliers and so on. I really, really do love it. And this is actually something that is quite expensive, guys, and it is definitely a professional platform. But because we take on a lot of coordinations as a business, it's something that I'm looking at potentially letting our customers have access to our platform if we're coordinating their wedding. So something that we're thinking about because it is such a good platform. It also makes it easier for us as a coordinator because then when it comes to the time for us to step in, everything's already on our planner. So we can literally see what's been going on and what's happening. We would have limited spaces, but it is something that we're considering. But it's an amazing platform. And if you haven't used it yet, then do if you're a wedding planner. So again, linking that one below for you. So another paid product that is very good value for money is our wedding planning toolkit. So this spreadsheet, so it's a six tab spreadsheet and it's sold at literally just 7 dollars So 
very, very affordable. And it has six different tabs so you can track your budget. So we've literally got this spreadsheet set up with all the different types of supplies that you would typically need for your wedding. We've got a column for the percentage of your budget that you're gonna allow. And there's also a link that takes you through to our wedding budget split spreadsheet. So you can actually see what you would typically allow towards each part of your wedding as well. You can then track how much you want to budget towards each element of the wedding, how much you actually spend and so on. There's also a payment scheduler tab so you can track when your first payment is due, when your second payment is due, when you've paid it and so on. So you can really keep track of everything that you're doing. There's another tab to keep track of all your contacts. So all the suppliers that you've booked, their contact details, their email addresses, even their Instagram, if you want to add that in, you can do. It's really, really handy, especially to have to send over to your venue so that they've got all the details that they need as well. There's also a tab to track your invitations and who's invited to basically the guest list and who's invited to what part of your wedding day, whether you've sent the invites, whether you've received the RSVPs and you have a tab to track your bridal party as well. And the final tab is really, really useful for both your venue and your caterer and that is for you to track or to note down your table plan. It's a case of working out who's on what table and then whether they've got any dietaries. And it's a really, really, really useful sheet for your venue and your caterer to have. It's something that they don't get sent very often and they don't get sent it in this format, but because we work with caterers and venues obviously all the time, we know that this is a format that they like. It makes it a lot easier for them. So, really really useful so spreadsheet and literally just retails at seven pounds 99 so again i have linked that below and that one is actually one of our products on our website one of my other favorite tools is also one of our products <laughs> and that is our design book template i love this and this is one of the most popular products that we sell in our shop and that is the design book template. So essentially, I have done a video on this, so I will link it up here for you. But to summarise, the template is where you can collate your whole design for your wedding. I absolutely love this product. You can choose your colour palette. It's used in Canva. So it's a real design platform, but you don't have to be design or techie. It's really, really easy platform. The platform to use Canva is absolutely free and the design book retails at $19.99. And you can add all the images in from your Pinterest boards. You can write up your whole wedding planning details, design, everything that you want. And then actually this is a really good product to use to then send out to all your suppliers once you've got your vision and your design together so that everybody is literally singing off the same hymn sheet and you're not sending them a Pinterest board which has probably got a bit crazy and got some old posts in there and you've changed your mind and so on. It's also a really good visual for you guys to really see the whole thing come together. And there's lots of prompts in there to make you think about how do I want this part of the day to look? How do I want this part of the day to run? And so on. That's a really popular product in our shop and I love it. And I use it for all of my clients when I'm designing for them. So it's not just a case of something that we send out to you, I use it as well. So it is one of my favorite tools to use when planning a wedding. And then finally, I've got two more tools that I use when planning a wedding. And these ones are absolutely free again, which is amazing. And they are, of course, Pinterest and Instagram. These two platforms are so image heavy. Instagram is obviously leaning into video a bit more and I think Pinterest is trying to go that way as well, interestingly, but that's another story. But both these tools are hugely image heavy and they are a great place to get those juices going when you're coming up with some ideas at the beginning of your wedding. And actually, even throughout the process, Pinterest is actually a search engine. Did you know that, guys? It is not a social media platform. It is a search engine, an image search engine. So it is one of the best places to get ideas. You obviously just need to remember to not get too sucked in and not get confused if they're a shoot and remember to be realistic. And again, I've done a video on Pinterest before, so I will link that for you. But both Pinterest and Instagram are amazing tools 
Instagram obviously has the capabilities of hashtags, which means that you can actually search some suppliers as well by putting in localized hashtags. For example, Surrey Wedding Coordinator or UK Wedding Planner or Surrey Wedding Caterer or Florida Destination Wedding Planner. That was random and that doesn't quite make sense, but you catch my drift. So you can actually look for suppliers that you like in your area. It's also great to have a look at people's portfolio because a lot of people now use Instagram as pretty much their shop window and their portfolio. And you can check out everything that they're doing, what they're up to, obviously we can watch stories and see how busy they are, what they get up to in their day-to-day -day life, whether you like them, whether you connect with them, whether you trust them, you can get to know them. And that is a much better way to choose your suppliers than just hopping onto Google and finding the first website that fits the bill, in my opinion, because I think it's all about connecting with your suppliers for your wedding day so that you really do trust them and they feel like they're part of your day. So guys, those are my favorite wedding tools for planning your wedding. There are some freebies and there are some paid products, but those are the things that I use when I'm helping my clients to plan their own weddings. And I also use them when I'm planning clients' weddings as well. So I hope you found those tools helpful. If you haven't heard of some of them before, then hopefully they'll help you with your wedding planning journey. Also, just a note, guys, I am so excited to tell you that my new podcast has just dropped. Oh, my days. Literally, it's insane. I can't believe... I can now say I've got a podcast. I mean, there's one episode out right now, but it's out. So if you would like to check that out, it is all about being a female business owner, looking after yourself as a business owner, but also I'm talking about marketing and business tips and strategy and just being a female entrepreneur, running their own business and all the things that we encounter and all the things that I have learned on my way of how to grow a successful, profitable business. So I will link that below for you guys as well. I would love you to go check it out. I hope you guys have a fantastic week and I will see you next week for some more wedding planning goodness. See you then guys.